Hi crafty friends, Cindy here with Treeline Studios. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I have the first of many unboxings of Diamond Art Club. Um, I have a lot. Let's see. I think I have like six boxes or seven total. Yep, this is actually, yep. Seven boxes, uh, separate uh, mailings of Diamond Art Club kits that I've amassed. And super excited to show you. Um, but let's get started. I took it out of the box already just so you wouldn't have to see me struggling with it. But today I have a round and a square. And that's how you can tell. This one's a, uh, they have a little circular, um, symbol and then the square, pink, and this is blue. Um, let's start with this one. This one I'm super excited about. It's a huge one. But this one, it's really heavy too, actually. This one is The Old Shoe House by Dominic Davison. It's a square, like I said, and it's a humongous one. Uh, one 105 centimeters by 70 centimeters. And this one um, drew my attention because it's really cute. It's got like a little um, shoe and then some mushrooms. So kind of like a cute little fantasy uh, like story or was it fairy tale type of thing, vibe. Um, but you guys, Diamond Art Club is... They are at the top of their game. Um, they've got really um, soft canvases and good drill quality, and they have like a good variety of licensed artwork. So if you haven't checked them out, um, definitely do so. Uh, there's a reason why they're so popular. And um, they are available at some craft stores now, although it's just like a more limited uh, amount. So of course their website will be where you can see all what they have. And if you are shopping and um, find something you'll like, uh, I'm actually happy to announce that I am an affiliate with them now. So you can use my code, uh, which is TREELINE, TREE, T-R-E-E, -E, and then LINE, um, to get 15% off for new customers. But super excited. So this one, um, this one will probably be the next one I work on. I currently have two... Uh, kits that I'm working on from other companies that I would like to at least finish one of them before I get started. But uh, as usual, uh, the canvas comes really well protected. It was in that box that you saw. Um, here's a little sticker with the legend. So this one has 57 colors. Jeez. <laughs> so, but here's the image. So freaking cute. Yeah, I'm really excited. This will look really nice once worked up. I just don't know how long it'll take. It is a square. I'm assuming there's going to be some confetti because the image looks really nice. But we will see. Um, and this is a sticker. So you can um, cut this up and put it on your kit and everything. And uh, that'll be nice and easy, which is another one of their um, pluses. Here's their toolkit in this little baggie. So usual... Um, little boat, two plates of the wax, a squishy, some baggies, the sharp tweezers, and then the little single placer. So standard boat, or excuse me, standard kit. Okay, let's get into this. So if any of you, oh, oh yes, and then here's a sticker. So this is the additional sticker I can put on the box um, uh, to organize your stash so you can see it easily. I'm pretty sure this is not going to fit on screen, but I will try to get as much as possible. Oh my god, what have I gotten myself into? <laughs> it is humongous. So humongous, but so cool looking. Alright, so there's the two bags of drills. We'll get into that soon. Um... Holy cow, I don't even know how I'm going to start working on this, but looks really nice. Let's start from the top here. All right, so their little logo, do what makes you sparkle. Um, the legend is on both the upper left and the lower right like we expect. And yeah, I'm actually having trouble <laughs> maneuvering this so you can see it, but really cool. So here's like this little like field of mushrooms, just so cute. So good thing is at least I do see some areas where there's a lot of color blocking. So for example, like this big mushroom here, this is a lot of solid color, so that should work out pretty fast. 
Um, but then other areas where there's more uh, little details, of course, is going to be kind of confetti heavy. But let's see. So there's a little bridge there, a little castle in the background. Um, really cute little rainbow, a tree, mountains in the background. All right, and here's uh, another pretty tree. It looks like a purplish. And this cute little boot house. <laughs> so cute. And then more background stuff. But this is the biggest canvas I have, I think. Because I'm having trouble maneuvering it so I can show you. Um, okay, here's the right edge here. Uh, a little boat here, some more cute little mushrooms. And of course the water and there's a little like canoe. But this is an awesome image. Like this is so cool. Really nice. So let's zoom in on the symbols there. Let's see. So here's a some good color blocking there. But symbol quality looks really clear as usual. Nothing too uh, crazy that looks like it'll um, give me trouble or anything. Awesome. Yeah. Really nice. Really, really nice. I am definitely going to have to find like a really big table to work on for this, but looks really nice. But yep, I love their canvas. It's like nice and thick and soft. Um, I'm working currently on another company's canvas and it just it does not compare. It just feels kind of like cheap. Um, also, it's fraying, so like their um, canvas, like the edges are scalloped to prevent flaring, uh, <laughs> to prevent fraying, which is always nice. Yeah, and then the symbols and everything, the legend are nice and big and clear. So Diamond Art Club, you do not disappoint as usual. Um, let me move this Dragundu canvas out of the way so we can take a look at the drills because I am like a foot away from my table. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Okay, so let's see. Am I zoomed out? Yes, I am. All right, so we got the instructions. If you don't know how to diamond paint, you can take a look at that. Um, let's see. Let's look at this one. I'm sorry my lighting's not so great today. It's kind of like a gloomy day here uh, in Florida. Um, we have like a tropical storm coming today from Eda or Etta so it's kind of just gloomy and blah but let's take a look at the drills wow so a lot of green of course which is the background let's try to take a look at the drills here so from what I can see drill quality looks good um to be determined though, once I start working it up, as I know it can be hard to tell through the baggies if there's anything going on, but from a distance it looks okay. Um, but just my one of my current canvases I'm working on right now, which is not Diamond Art Club, um, when I unboxed it, it looked good, and then turns out there's a lot of trash. So, so to be determined, I'll of course do a post review. But wide range of colors. What did I say again? It was 57 colors. Holy cow. That's a lot. So, really, the colors are the rainbow, all types. There's another strip here. Oh, here's one of the ABs. I had seen someone post this actually earlier today. So pretty. This, like, pale pink AB. So, so pretty. And if you don't know, AB stands for Aurora Borealis. So, these kind of special drills that have that special coating make it look more sparkly and pretty. Love that coral. Oh, here's the other AB. So this like uh, light lime green AB. Awesome. And then here's the other AB right next to it. This uh, pale yellow AB. So pretty. Is there more than three ABs for this kit? I don't know. Well, so far there's three. Awesome. So I know I'm not. I'm doing this unboxing a little later. I'm sure some people already got this kit and are working on it. Uh, if you are, how's it coming along? Is it really nice? Leave a comment. <laughs> All right, here's the second bag here. 
of drawers. Yeah, this is a lot, a lot. Some more greens. Awesome. It's like a big old salad. Green, blue, navy, black, tan, gray, white, more gray, more neutrals. Oh, this is such a pretty, like, mint green. I love that color. Baby blue, violet, purple. Awesome. So, yeah, it looks like there's three ABs. I am excited to get this started. So, yeah, this is definitely uh, next on my list. Um, to be honest, like, my current kit that I'm working on, like, I love the image. Uh, like I said, it's a different company. But just I'm having so much trash rolls, it's kind of frustrating. So, I kind of want to just, like, kit this up and start. But then I'll have three that I'm working on. So, I don't know. <laughs> So then move that out of the way, we'll open up the next kit. Okay. So next kit is around, and this one's the Blue Winter Lynx by Sheena Pike. And the size is 56 centimeters by 71 centimeters. So this cute little lynx, very like wintry and blue, looks pretty. Hope you guys are having a great day and weekend. It's been an eventful weekend with the election. So regardless of um, what your affiliation is, I'm sure it was either an exciting weekend or not so much. <laughs> so we'll just keep it at that. Okay. So, so cute. So here's a legend. So this one is much smaller, 25 colors. Um, and look at those two cute little links. And they're like holding diamonds. So I'd assume the AB would be what they're holding. Really cute. Here's that little sticker again for the outside of your box. And then the toolkit, which we don't have to go through again. All right, so this one's much more of a manageable size. Ooh. Oh my goodness. This is so pretty. It's so cute. I love the color palette. So just like a lot of light blues, just very like pastel and calming. Very pretty. Awesome. So cute. So yeah, compared to the, the last one, this is like a tiny one. <laughs> But still probably gonna take a little bit. Uh, let's see, let's take a zoom in at the symbols. So yep, so with the round two, just very uh, clear, very clear symbols. And oh yes, and I forgot to mention, this is the poured glue, which is what Diamond Art Club uses. So that's why there's the clear cover. Um, and the po poured glue in general does um, work better and doesn't have issues such as for with double-sided tape or double-sided yes tape using some of the cheapo kits but really nice awesome so yeah so this is I think the first diamond art clubs rounds I've looked at or maybe looked at that up close so it does look like they have some of like the um, dark circles around the symbol, which, you know, if you prefer or not, just FYI. But yeah, a lot of neutrals and then a lot of blue. Very pretty. Awesome. So cute. Okay, right. so let's look at the drills for this one. So as you can see, lots of blue and gray. Gorgeous. So pretty. So let's see the drills. Yep, they look nice. All nice and even colored and uh, no knobbly bits that I can see. They look good. So again, I'll, I'll do a post review once I finish one of my kits here. Uh, so many blues. 
all the blues. That mint green again, beautiful. Awesome. And then the other strip. Let's see here. More blues, and even lighter, like light, light green. Like it almost looks white, but there's like a green tinge to it. So pretty. Here's the AB. So this is the white AB. There's two baggies of it. So I'd imagine that's the um, little uh, diamond drop things. Oh, well, let's see. Let's take a look. Let's confirm. So number 141. Uh, 141 is one. So let's see. One. Oh, I lie. Uh, actually, yeah, a little bit. Okay, yeah. So one is in here that I see also, like the face of the links, kind of scattered all over the place. One. And then a little diamond, yeah, a little diamond dripping here too. So I guess anywhere that's kind of white um, to accentuate. Awesome. All right, so yeah. And then the more blues, navy blue, gray. So yeah, looks like this uh, 180 for this one. And our colors. Awesome. Sweet. Oh, man. So yep, another two diamond paintings that I can't wait to work up. Um, but I am probably going to try to work on the first one, the bigger one with the shoe and the uh, mushrooms <laughs> first whenever I get to it. So um, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, feel free to comment if you have any questions or uh, if you're working on this kit yourself. And uh, if you like this video, feel free to like it and subscribe to my channel. Uh, like I mentioned earlier, if you're new to diamond painting, you haven't checked out Diamond Art Club yet, please do. Um, there's a reason that they're so popular. They have a lot of kits, really good quality, um, relatively affordable. And, um, you know, you feel free to use that discount code I mentioned. So it's Treeline, which I'll link in the, um, the description below this video. And also they just kind of keep releasing stuff. So this is how I have become so like <laughs> addicted to buying Diamond Art Club because most of the time they have new releases uh, every Saturday. So, and then I get tempted and buy more. So, <laughs> but, um, yep, I have plenty of other, uh, boxes from them that I'm going to unbox in the near future. So I'll see you next time. Have a good rest of the day. Bye.